What's up guys? Eddie Alho here with KissAnalog.com. This is another piece I need for my new lab. It's an LCR meter so I can read inductance, capacitance, and resistance. And shocked around a bit. I think this one had pretty good specs and a pretty good price. Let's take a look. Amazon. Oh, air pillows. All right. Nice large display. Looks pretty cool. All right, let's open that up. All right, so let's see what's inside this guy. Okay, this looks like, uh, what is this? Calibration, oh, it's a test report. Okay, so it looks like calibration slash test report. Manufacturer fluke. Now that's interesting. That's really interesting. It says fluke here, model 9100. Okay. Maybe that was the instrument they used to calibrate. And looks like a, actually a nice little booklet here. Uh, that actually looks pretty nice. Ruby Electronics, thank you for your business. Okay, it's got some nice, nice test probes here. Those are nice. These are made so you can plug them right into a banana jack. It's really nice. Sharp tip. Wow, they have a nice fill to them. And they came with some extension type probes uh, with a long tip with a little protector, also sharp. They have a nice fill as well. And these are tweezers. This is so you can measure small surface mount or through hole components. It's pretty cool. Okay, wow. That is a neat probe. Wow, another one that plugs into banana jack. That is very interesting. It has two probes here. You know, I don't even know what this one's for. I will have to do a little investigation to find out what this one's for. Huh. And another green test lead. Also nice filling on that one. They almost feel like silicone. Maybe not quite. I'm not sure what that material is. Very nice though. And we got some big alligator jaws. Huh. Okay. Has a made in China, of course, at this kind of price. Has the little captures here to hold the probes in place. Storage, that's nice. Has a nice feel to it. This is a nice rubberized case. Wow. It's 
nice display. That's huge. Wow. And has guard, two guard poles, plus minus, another plus and minus for blades, and a guard up here too. And of course you're always supposed to discharge your capacitors before testing capacitors. Huh. That is very nice. You can't see that illuminate because I've got so much light here, but I don't know. Maybe you can see that. That's a nice meter. A CEN DT9935. We will put this in action and I will show you how it's going to work. Nice buttons here though. Very nice fill to them. Oh, I'm impressed. I think that's going to do the job. And this was very affordable. I'm going to show the price right here above. I have to go check again. But it has a nice battery indicator. Lots of a bar graph. Um, wow, pretty cool. Okay. We'll do step two and go a little further with this guy to see how it works. Alright, thanks for watching.